This is going to be a short video just to showcase and compare the new Bark River Crusader uh, with the Bark River Survivor. These are in 3B but I think the, the specs aside from the steel is about the same with the A2 version. Uh, you can see that they have changed the sheet uh, a bit from the original. Uh, I do prefer the new design. Uh, which is uh, sort of like the, um, the new design sheets for, for the, the entire Bravo series um, made by skin benders, I think they're called. Uh, anyways, let's take a quick look at the, um, the knives. can take a quick look at the, at the sheath as well. Uh, this is what it looks like for the Crusader. Some molly straps for uh, scout carrying. You have the uh, fire steel loop. And then, yeah. This is, you know, I don't have a whole lot to say to be honest. Uh, just a mm, pretty, you know, standard, although versatile sheath for different carrying styles. Uh, no complaints, no issues. It's, um, I think it's a good design and it's a, a definitive improvement over the, the original uh, Survivor sheath. So the knives. This is the original 3B Survivor. It's a pretty compact, uh, wide blade. Good for a number of different purposes. The shoulder to choke up a bit for finer work. But you can also do some, some real chopping and stuff with it, should you want to. Um, I have done uh, not a lot of chopping, but well, maybe, you, maybe I have done a lot of chopping to be honest. But it, to me, this wasn't the most comfortable handle nor design for, uh, for chopping, or especially not extended uh, chopping for extended periods of time. Times. This is a slightly larger survivor. The blade is wider. I think it's about 1.5 inches longer. And this, this should be, I don't have the specs, but I think this is about 8.5 inches uh, with the survivor being 7.5. One, two, five, around seven inches. Yeah. The thickness, yeah, the, let's see if we can get them both. The thickness is about the same. Uh, this one is 0 0 0.218 inches thick, which is really thick for Bark River. And this one I think is 0.270 or 265 maybe or 270. So it's just a slight difference in, in thickness. You won't even notice it uh, regardless of how close I, I show it in camera. You will not see the difference in thickness. But there is a slight difference. Uh, Something you will see instantly uh, is the handle design. This is the survivor handle. This is the crusader handle. Let's see if we can do some... Oops. Ah. 
Okay, let's see the handles a bit. These handles are different. Um, the Crusader handle is slightly longer, slightly thicker, wider, and with a more flared bottom of the of the handle, uh, which will give you uh, a bit better grip in hand. But it might also be a slight concern in comfort when doing tasks such as as chopping. I do prefer the new handle design. It may not be perfect for my hands. Uh, I will um, I will use a bit of sandpaper to make it not as as sharp and edgy uh, on the sides here. But this is uh, an improvement, definitely, in my opinion. Uh, if I didn't, if I failed to mention it, the blade on the Crusader is also wider than the, uh, the Survivor. You can also see that there's a higher grind. I don't, I'm not sure if you can see that, but it, it is a higher grind on the Crusader compared to the um, Survivor. This one and this Survivor are both in pink G10, black liners and uh, mosaic pins. Uh, the other Survivor, which I brought with me here, is uh, in a uh, really dark Burgundy canvas micarta with some uh, mosaic pins and white liners. I think we might be losing focus. Um, But I think this should conclude my first uh, hands-on um, review of sorts. Uh, 